doubt you're an amazing young athlete and you've got a lot of potential. However, some say your fights are rigged and there is no way you could win a fight against a true cha champion. Now, I've got to ask you, what do you got to say to those people who have said this? Well, hold on a second. Are you trying to say that I'm not a true champion? I have beaten every champion that stood in my way. I am the best and I cannot be beaten. I haven't said anything. I'm simply telling you what people have said. And that is, you would lose against Dwayne Aton. Look, I don't believe this. Have I not proven to the world yet that I am the first ever 20 year old lightweight world champion? You think an old man is gonna stand in my way? No chance on earth. You know what? Stuff this. I challenge Dwayne Aton to a fight anywhere, any place, any time. Dwayne tweeted me. Coach, Dwayne's tweeted me. Man, I'm gonna kill this guy. Don't let your ego blind you. Boss, trust me, I'm gonna kill this guy. I got this. Sorry. It's fine. You want to have a fight, don't worry. It's all good. So the results, mate. Looks like a fractured rib on your lower rib. Yeah. You're gonna have to keep your movement to a minimum for four weeks. Will I be able to fight? You goddamn better be. You're gonna crush that kid. I want to see some good old-fashioned boxing from you. Thanks, mate. It means a lot. No worries. Now look, you got one more chance to rebuild your leg seat. Do not waste this. Alright. Stick to the plan, mate. All right, he's still a good fighter. Stick to the plan. Go stick to the plan. All right, boss. All right. Of course I am. I'm the best and ain't no one gonna take that away from me. Dwayne, what do you say about that? We'll see what happens tomorrow. I've been training so much and whatever happens on the day, the best man will win. Actions speak louder than words. We all know what's gonna happen tomorrow. You're finished. All right, boys, settle. Weighing in at 79.9 kilos, Kent!
Weighing in at 74.2 kilos. Dwayne! It's face off time. Break it up, boys, break it up! Fight before the fight. We all knew it was going to happen after all the Twitter wars and social media controversy. Kent and Dwayne were going to fight sooner or later. For all you at home, I urge you to stay tuned tomorrow, 7 p.m., live on FTV. Between Dwayne and Ken in the Wayne room the day before the fight has caused the world to stop, and it's the only thing the public is talking about. There was heavy speculation that the conflict was fake. However, the brutal exchange truly shows that the two fighters mean business. Social media has been overtaken by this morning's weigh-in, and I cannot imagine what will happen when the fight for the title of lightweight champion is up for grabs. It's been months in waiting and it's finally here tomorrow, 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And we are underway. Now this is the kind of fight that we're here for. First blow. Dwayne, not slow to hit back. Can you feel the energy in this room right now? Ken is in such good shape. Look at him, fighting with ease. Hey, now speaking of good shape, have you seen Dwayne just coming out of a broken rib injury and still in the best shape of his life? Yeah, no doubt about it. These boys are more than prepared for this fight. Both Ken and Dwayne staring each other down as we start round two. What a heck of a show these guys have put on for us tonight. Supporting them here tonight. Yeah, that's right. Nothing to lose now, and I can assure you all at home, this is the round to watch. Round 10, here we come, let's go. Can't take away blaming death for the blows. Oh, my God.